UMass steals it back. Siner, far right wing corner in the Lowell zone. Siner, Phillips, score! Adam Phillips, the one-timer, seemed to go off the heel of a stick, but he got enough mustard behind it to get it behind Doug Carr. That's a power play goal for UMass as the Minutemen take a 1-0 lead. Well, Chase Langrap had the first uh, good opportunity on that power play as he came down the slot getting a deflection he wasn't expecting. Still got good wood on it. Carr made the stop. And then the Minutemen with a good set play coming back to Phillips at the right point. Here Sp comes Michael Lacombe for UMass in a low ice. Centers it for Sheary. He shoots and scores! Wetmore wins a draw. Here's a shot by Edwards. Stopped by Paul. Okay. 2 on one developing. Lang wrapped down the left wing with shooting and a save made. And a rebound the is jumping, knocking jumping. into play. Cublin will shoot and a save by Cullen. Right side of the net for Siner. In front for Hobbs. He shoots and scores. It came to the left side of the net to Adam Phillips who actually finished it. As Phillips cheated in from the left point. Adam Phillips is becoming a power play specialist. He scores his second goal of the game. Fifth of the season, another power play goal by the Minutemen, and they take a 3 0 lead. In there. I know on your call originally when Langrap came to the front, I think you almost thought he could have shot. He came yeah, into the I, slot. I, really thought he was I shoot thought, him. Yeah. I think you were ready to yell backhand shot, but instead he gave it up. But Hobbs, the unselfish play there to give it up to Phillips, who uh, charged in there. The Minutemen the other way, D'Angelo, shooting one, save Carr, rebound, a great oh. save by Carr. on the power play. Paul Dayton with a dandy glove save here as he tumbles from his right to his Final left. score from the Mullins Center. UMass four and Lowell one. Yeah.